While many of you likely stayed inside as much as you could today, some people didn't really have a choice. Our Steve Pickett is live for us now in Dallas, where he spoke to people who had to work in this cold today, including you, Steve. You're not the only one out there in the cold. <laughs> hey, it, it, kid, it's a, it's a balmy 32 right now. What are you talking about? It's sun shining. It's a great day. I'm, I'm actually told you can stay warmer if you just keep moving around, folks. Believe me. I've been moving around. I'll tell you where we've been. We have talked to a variety of folks who may not be as happy as me today facing the frost of this North Texas Monday. I mean, it has been cold. We found hardworking landscape folks, those crews braving these conditions, the team from Landry's Landscape, they started working about 7 o'clock this morning. Or what if you're on a supply delivery route at 26 degrees? All earlier this morning, come along for the ride for that kind of work that we saw from one individual today. Whether you were waiting on the public transit lines, walking on the streets of the downtown business district to your office, or on that construction crew with a deadline that does not care about the cold of this morning. The work day outside, for a lot of folks, simply cold to the core. The cold, I mean, it's, it's insane. I mean, it's just... I mean, there's no way to take it off from you, you know? It's, it's cold. <laughs> it's colder than cold. Yes. Yes, I can say that it is cold. We didn't thought that it was going to be that cold, but uh, like I was explaining to you a little while ago, tomorrow we're not going to be outside. Now, you know by Friday it's supposed to be 80 degrees. Oh, yeah, I'm ready for that. I'm ready. Yeah, I'm ready for that. I'm real ready for that. Right. <laughs> Uh, some folks were uh, freezing their petunias off, uh, literally. We'll, we will explain that aspect of that story at 4.30, protecting your plants, if you will. A little bit more on that. For now, uh, I've got to get back into a car here because um, I can't talk anymore. Ken Gilma, back to you. Steve, stay, stay warm. Thank you.